Look at this book. This is the today, okay? And uh, we're gonna have on left the Arch of Constantine, and on right, this is the real amphitheater. Hmm? Here is the place where it used to be the statue, the statue of Nero, the real Colossus. Look. Wow. You see that? Mm -hmm. Yes. This 120 feet. And this one was 150 feet. So they always been called different. The Colossus, so like a meeting point for the Romans. And even this an amphitheater. An amphitheater is a double theater. A theater is an circle. If you make two of those facing each other, you have an amphitheater. Because ampis in Greek means double. Now, when the barbarians they came to Rome, what they did on the 410 AD? They destroyed the statue, and the nickname of this statue here being transferred from the statue to this. Uh, Got it? So yeah. this one is called Colossus, Colosseum, then with a the, with the slang, you know, being changed in the name, only because the name originally was about this statue. Okay? All right. You read it? Fantastic. Very interesting. Also, a view of these beautiful families. <laughs> look, look at these beautiful kids. <laughs> All right. Now, I'm going to leave this, yeah. okay? And now we did. Did you see that? Yeah. Oh, look. Okay. Give me you. Look. See, just a portion of the stage. You see that? On the right. Just to give you an idea how that was before. Okay, and then even that portion of the seats on the on the right, just to give you an idea, everything here being transformed from when from when Constantine declared that the official religion into the Roman Empire is supposed to be which one, the Christian one. So this one building was being used from the 80 after Christ until to the 313 AD. Then Romans they don't permit any more any fighting between people. Okay, that's why. So the emperor is to have a seat up there. There's a kind of an empty space up there. See that? A room. Okay. North. From the east, on the right, they were entering the gladiators. Okay. That means down there below, through that arch. Okay. On the right. There we go. From this side. Well, look at my finger working so well now. Oh, yeah. on the right. okay. <laughs> and. Uh, the, so the gladiators and the slaves, even on the left, they were exiting, the, if they were alive. If they were alive, they were exiting through the same way to get in. If they died, they used to get out through the west. People carried by chariot direction to the cemeteries. What about the animals? Animals distributed as a complementary food. To the people at uh, that time outside, starving. So they're ready with the barbecues. Have you ever tasted zebra? <laughs> no, but when you starve, believe me, you everything. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, that's why. So here inside, about sixty thousand people, fifty and sixty thousand people watching games. So from the morning to the evening, doesn't matter, you know, uh, the long time. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So the first time when Titus opened this building here, he wanted to have one hundred days of games. During that games, five thousand animals died. Five Let's go. Be mind. Look at the beautiful oleanders we have on right and left. Oleanders. Even the cypress. You see the cypress in front of us is a is a is a tree, slim, uh, always been planted from the Romans age into cemeteries. And you know why? Because that looks like a finger is pointing to God. So it's like a religious tree. Okay? That what is a uh, is a, is a cypress for in the United States you guys call these trees uh, uh, Italian cypress isn't it so this like this is exactly how was Rome at that time look could be a picture a postcard of uh, uh, how much 200 300 years ago the, the, this area today this area is owned by the Vatican this is an, a holy place for us the catacombs okay now this one are like uh, uh, I can see on left even convents where the uh, 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 you know people like a uh, uh, man or boy even boys they, they started to be a priest on left we have a statue of Tarcisius 
Tarcisius. He was a, a 15 years old uh, boy who had been captured by the Romans and killed because he was carrying the holy uh, sacrament, the Eucharistic, you know, on his hands. You see that? What is it protecting and uh, hiding mm -hmm. on his hand? Okay, so he became, a, of course, a martyr. Okay, it's Tarcisius. Look at this. We are now uh, uh, following this beautiful entry and we are arriving into the uh, catacombs entry. Now you guys are gonna have a tour guide uh, uh, coming with you. Uh, of course, it will be English speaking tour guide. All right. All right. Two and a half. Two and a half? Yeah. I have one of those. <laughs> Actually, now she's three, but... Oh, wow. Pretty close. Cool. 